Hey, I'm Nick Boy, and welcome to Pocket. And today I'm sitting down to play Yoshi's Woolly World, and I've dressed appropriately for the occasion because this jumper is made out of 100% pure, authentic Yoshi skin. Mm. Yoshi's Woolly World is the first home console Yoshi game since Yoshi's Story back in 1997, 18 years ago. What have I done with my life? Well, apparently a lot more than Yoshi. Now, Woolly World has taken the sort of Kirby's epic yarn wool look and applied it to Yoshi. And I'm gonna say from the title screen, great decision. Welcome to Craft Island, a tiny place in the middle of the handmade ocean. Oh no. Oh no, Harry Potter. Sorry to drop in so suddenly, but I need to turn you all into yarn. Thanks. Aren't you already made of yarn? Oh. Balls of yarn. God, that's creepy. Think about what's actually happening there. He's turned up to a society and he's chopped them all up into pieces and put them in a bag. This is a children's game. Oh, it's so pretty. Hey, chubby cheeks. Press down. And he poops. All right, so these little yarn poops are just stand-ins for the eggs that Yoshi used to shoot out. It's exactly the same gameplay, just yarn-based. Ooh. Oh! Oh! He loved that. It's Ark Survival Evolved all over again. It's just poop. Poop is the new bow and arrow. Oh, yeah. Yeah, get out the big one. He's obviously had just, like, a big curry. It's funny how all Nintendo games are exactly the same. And I don't necessarily mean that in a bad way. It's just that this is this is Mario, but with Yoshi. The the world structure is exactly the same. The ideas are all the same. There's just tweaks on formula. Is this a criticism? We're not entirely sure. It's a safety blanket because you go. I grew up with uh, Mario games. I love Nintendo, old Nintendo games like that. And at the same time, you just go. Didn't I buy this game like six months ago? The answer is no, you didn't, because it's been 18 years. <laughs> Oh, such a sense of accomplishment. Through the hole! Very satisfying. Look at those feet. Oh, he's so happy. Bonus game. Oh, look at the apples. None of this is yarn. What's going on? Are these like buttons or something? I should do something. Jump! 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 Okay, here's the thing when you introduce a bonus game, you should probably give the player the tiniest bit of context as to what's about to happen. Okay, I think since I played the first level, maybe I'll jump out to the start screen, uh, jump on someone else's account, and play, you know, something a bit further in to see how the game changes. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, so you unlock modifiers. Choose a power badge, fall into a pit, no problem. Immunity to fire and lava. Right, cool. Make all yarn balls big. Okay, so you unlock, yeah, so these are like little modifiers for your course. Play alongside Poochie. Well, definitely that one. <gasps> Look at that dog. Ah, oh, he's so adorable. Hey, buddy, let's lick each other. Oh no. Get out of the way, dog. Ah. Oh. I'm sorry I shot you with that thing I'm eating. Ah! Pooch! <laughs> no! Oh, he's fine. Ah! Okay, I'm fine. There is so much going on on this screen. He chased the yarn ball. He chased it. Ah! Is the dog helping me or just hindering? <laughs> like, I'm climbing on him, he's blocking my yarn shots. I keep just licking him. Oh, I keep thinking he's a bad guy. Oh yeah, yep, yep, dog's helping. Pooch! Pooch! <laughs> Couldn't help me then, could you, dog? Even though you can fly! Checkpoint. What world are we on? Three? Doesn't seem that much harder. Maybe I'm just great. Maybe it turns out the games that I'm best at are Yoshi games. And I just don't know because they only put out one every decade. Look at these moves. Where was this when I was playing Counter-Strike Go? Not missing a beat. I'm missing a beat, guys. Ah! A beat! 
I missed a beat! <laughs> no, don't die! Please! No, I was being so cocky! Oh. There's a nice consistency of design here. The design of the backgrounds and stuff is really nice. It's all got that homemade feel. It's kind of like a kid just put up a blue sheet in his bedroom and then somehow made a video game. Boop. Oh. Oh! What happened there? Did it bounce off the wall? Amazing. Pretty much a Nintendo world champion right there. All right, so Yoshi's Woolly World. It's really fun. It controls great. Obviously, the art style is just beautiful, and Yoshi is a really cute character. Yoshi's probably my favorite Nintendo character. Uh, haven't had a game with him for ages, but just in terms of looking at and his personality and stuff, I, I, I really like that character. If you own a Wii U, this game is for you because you bought a Nintendo console because you love Nintendo games, and this is a Nintendo game through and through. So you will you will totally love this game. I don't think it's going to sell consoles because if Mario didn't sell consoles and if Kirby didn't sell consoles, then I don't think Yoshi is because it's pretty much just the same as those games with Yoshi's face on it. But it certainly is my favorite looking Nintendo game in ages. And you get to play as Yoshi, so savor it, because it's gonna be another 18 years before that happens again. All right, that's it for today's episode of Pocket. Nick Boy, out. Sock you.